Amen. It's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. Some new exclusive 2K23 info, man. We got all the pre-order bonuses, um, a new cover, and some, some new park info, man. So make sure y'all watch this full video, man. I'm going to keep you in tune. I'm going to help you figure out which pre-order you should buy for yourself. And um, yeah, man. Make sure y'all drop a like, man. It helps out the video a lot. But anywho... The city is confirmed back in 2K23. <laughs> y'all let me know if y'all think that's an L. I, I think that's an L. F*** the city. You know, I want to go back to the old days. Even though they did fix the issue of letting us be able to um, get games way more consistently, unlike in current gen and um, previous 2Ks, because now it's like one server in a little park, and they like turn around the players and stuff, so you can't see them on the spot etc it helps you get more games for y'all that haven't played next gen um but as it says right here he probably translated this from some foreign website that dropped this whole too early but um it says join the biggest hoops community make your name in the city the biggest basketball world yet or embark on an epic voyage aboard the only cruise ship the cruise ship confirmed the city confirmed so copy paste Y'all let me know if y'all thought the if y'all think the cruise ship was an L or not. I think it was a super L, way too overhyped. Oh my god, I thought it was gonna be so much better. That shit was really trash. Y'all rate the cruise ship down below. Like it was really garbage. Like as soon as I saw the the water was gray, I thought they was gonna be going to all different type of places and it was just gonna be like lit was ass but they gonna bring it back they not in touch with the community like who want the cruise ship again so so basically what this is telling me is they're gonna stay with these ideas like why the cruise ship like i don't like the cruise ship uh, i don't know uh, the, the city's cooler to me now that you can get games and shit but i mean it's still it's too too, too big pause <laughs> But yeah, man, y'all let me know how y'all feel about that information. Epic voyage aboard the only cruise ship fit for the best ballers in the game. No matter the journey with your mind player. Be ready to work, gain rep, and run the courts. Test your limits in the Gatorade training facility. League, league, league. Cruise ship, league, league. City, league, league. And hit the shops for the freshest gear from the biggest brands before you compete and year-round events earning rewards to keep you locked make sure y'all flame these niggas with these brands and um like when they be releasing these clothes man like attack 2k not 2k intel they do not work for 2k attack nba 2k bro about these damn vc prices for this game man they just secured another the nba league pass deal i'm sure they getting buku money nigga but let's get into the rest of the news Okay, so as you see below, niggas hate the cruise, city overhated. The city is overhated now that you can get more games. It really is. Um y'all y'all just haven't played it, man. I'm trying to tell you, bro. Look, bro ain't no way we they had a whole year to work on the game and we getting NBA 2K22 part 2, bro. You see, they ain't like it. Look, no one likes it, bro. People be thinking YouTubers be manipulating niggas, bro. These, this is niggas' honest opinions, bro. This is how people feel, dog. Look, <laughs> nigga not buy it. I bet you this nigga buy that, hoe. <laughs> Anywho, man, these are the prices for the new editions. The championship edition, which includes the NBA pass. I will definitely be getting this. Um, the details about these, I'm going to be showing soon. The Michael Jordan edition is 100 and the standard Devin Booker edition is 70. This should be another Michael Jordan edition. Um, Y'all let me know down below which one you are going to get. 150 for a fucking video game is insane. But it includes the NBA League Pass. And I think that whole be like $300 or something. Or some, some crazy price to where... Let's get into it, man. Hold on. Yeah, you see, here's the pre-order bonuses for the championship edition. To be honest, dog, let me give y'all some advice, man. So, 154 game is crazy, especially if you don't watch the NBA. I know most of you 2K niggas do not watch basketball. You don't. And there, I know you don't. So, there's, there's really no reason for you to get this edition, bro. To be honest, 
because I know y'all niggas don't watch. But now, if you're trying to get into basketball, you know, be a great Samaritan trying to enjoy the game. This will be a way easier way to watch at a way higher quality. So it's a, it's a really like a steal, bro. Like it, it really, it really is. But if you don't watch basketball, if you're one of these weird 2K niggas, which is most of you niggas, you know, niggas, niggas play the game all day. Niggas, a heated rivalry. Niggas is doing all types of stuff. Playoffs. You don't watch that whole. You're on 2K playing. You don't even watch the finals. You're on to. You're weird as fuck, bro. I don't know how you niggas don't enjoy nothing in life or try to enjoy it. Y'all niggas really just be playing 2K. You're only engulfed with 2K, bro. That has to be some type of like weird disease, bro. Like that shit is weird, bro. Enjoy other things in life, my nigga. That's why y'all take this shit so serious, bro. Try to enjoy other shit, man. The NBA League Pass price is like $14.99 a month. And then the premium is $30 a month. So it's like it's kind of steel, to be honest. But um, you get a 12-month NBA League Pass subscription, Michael Jordan-themed go-karts. <sighs> Y'all niggas better not do these copy-paste rewards again. I swear to God, bro. <laughs> uh, 10 times, 10 percent XP boost on my team and my career season progression. Uh, okay, for how long? Dual gen entitlement, same console family. Uh, I guess you get both gens. 100k virtual virtual currency. Of course, they not giving niggas more than that, dumbass man. I hate to get 10k my team points. I don't know why they don't switch shit up. I mean, they they finally did it with this, but they they gotta switch shit up, bro. It's a different pre-order shit. 23 my team promo packs. Free agent option, my team, my team, Ruby coach card, my team, 10 boost, uh, skill, skill boost, leak, uh, Gatorade, give us more. Four cover athlete t-shirts for your my player, uh, my player backpack and arm sleeve, custom designs, one, two hour, uh, yeah, 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 you gotta do better. Let's see what niggas feel about it. This shit finna be ass. I don't know how y'all get sighted anymore. I don't go. Does that mean cross platform? And keep in mind, they said uh, season progression. So that means seasons battle pass shit is returning. Hopefully they add another rep system to it. What um rep system would y'all like them to add to the game? Or new rep system would y'all like them to add to the game along with the uh, seasons level 40 or whatever they make next year? Here's the Michael Jordan edition pre pre-order bonus. Nothing different. You get the same exact shit. Wait, custom skateboard. You get the same exact shit besides the pass. So I guess the pass they doing like 50. So I guess the pass you're paying 54. If you do if you do the lowest version 15 times 12, that's 180 if you was to buy the league pass by itself. Or if you was to get the premium version, which is 30 times 12, that's 360. So, I mean, it is a steal, bro. And y'all could actually, like, watch what you're trying to reenact and learn the game of basketball. Like, I don't know, bro. I, I think it's worth it. Um, That championship version, to be honest, bro. Like, all year, 12 months? Come on. Then, even if you're only going to use it for the playoffs, like, I don't know. I don't know. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. But, um, this ain't really about shit. Both 2Ks, it's, it's up to you. If y'all, listen, guys, if you get a fucking PS5 or a next-gen console, dog, do not fucking play current gen. Like, play both gens, nigga. Like, or at least, like, next gen. Like, come on, nigga. Here's the new cover. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Uh, this angle is like fire, but I ain't fucking, I don't think Devin Booker deserves to be on some 23. Like this actually looks clean to me, bro. To be honest.
What, what, do, what do y'all rate this? Like, these might be like the best covers I've seen from like 2K, bro. I don't know. I see niggas say it, like disliking it and some niggas liking it. Usually the covers don't be about shit. Um, I don't know. It look hard to me, nigga. Here the P5 shit. This shit look nice too. Or here's the uh, championship edition. It look nice to me. I mean, the covers don't really matter unless you like collecting this shit. But um, I don't know. I'm I'm just commenting on it. Like, <clears throat> and for you weird niggas that be in the comments, look, I'm not hyping up the game, bro. Like, dog. If you niggas know me, bro, I'd be roasting the shit out the game to where creators like hate me, nigga. Like, stop it, bro. <laughs> Wrong nigga, bro. Like, I'm just commenting on it, telling my feelings, pussy. Okay, now we got some more exclusive info. This nigga Mike Wang has some new like tweets. This little bitch, nigga. So, you know, uh, Little Sin tweets out about Community Day. And he liked this, right? So maybe they brought this back in secret. Maybe this is why they're releasing the news cycle, like, earlier than it's ever been. Maybe we're going to get some more info later on about 2K23. I don't know. And um, also, so this nigga commented under uh, Baluba's uh, of him saying, you know, you still alive? Barely. Okay, so he's saying he's been working his ass off and that he's barely alive, which is good because we don't fuck with Mike Wayne. Right, niggas? Real nigga Academy? We don't fuck with that nigga. Goofy ass nigga. But, um... This nigga says, that means you put your blood, sweat, and tears into this new 2K, right, Mike? And he liked it. So, I mean, I ain't never seen him like some shit like this. Maybe it's a hopeful thing. I doubt it. I'm sure the game's gonna be fucking ass. Hopefully, it's great, man. Hopefully, it's popping. That's what I really care about, nigga. If the game is ass or not, hopefully, it's popping, nigga. So, I can get my bands <laughs> and uh, entertain you bitch niggas. And actually enjoy it, man. So, you know, that's what I care about the most. But, um, anywho, man, y'all turn on your noties, man. I'm going to be covering all the 2K23 news, all the best exploits, all the best badges, all the best jump shots, dribble moves, builds, all that stuff all year. So, um, entertaining shit, toxic shit. So, make sure y'all subscribe, turn on them noties. Out this hoe, my boy. But hey, hey, here we go again, yeah, here, here we go again, people talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me, now break it down, yo, off the top of the dome, dome.